Today I'm doing a review of the Gillette Pro Glide Shield. It says it's lubrication before and after the blades. You can kind of see the bars here. So I guess the idea of the shield part is the lubrication before and after the, the razors. So it does have the flex ball technology to turn and it does pivot back and forth. So it's got plenty of uh, mobility. So I'm really a fan of the Gillette five blade razors, but this one's definitely a little bit unique. Well, so we'll see how it goes. I always rinse my blades with hot water and then rinse them off with hot water as I go. Cause that uh, helps open up the pores too for a closer comfortable shape. Woo, absolutely pain free so far. The only thing I worry about with a razor like this, like the Gillette Skin Guard, it doesn't shave close enough. So hopefully this one gets close enough to the skin. Hmm. All right, well, there you go. I already shaved half my face, so I'll let you know how the rest of it goes. I'm all done with the uh, Gillette Pro Glide Shield. I had high hopes for this razor, but I was pretty disappointed just because uh, the lubricating strips actually keep you from getting close enough to the skin to get a close shave. So it's definitely a fail for me. If you have really sensitive skin, I would go with the Gillette Skin Guard, but uh, I just really don't see any reason to buy this razor when you can get a basic five blade Gillette razor, even like the Gillette Labs Exfoliating, or I really like the new Gillette X razor if you want a five blade non-powered razor. So there you go.